How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Thank you guys so much for joining us here. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful, my handsome Gemini's out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please say the press that doesn't want doesn't leave that shit around. Also, this could be the past, the present, or the future. And if you have scammers in the comment section, pretend to be me, ask for a little bit of change. Um, you know, with the numbers, uh, giving out a WhatsApp number, I don't do that. And I don't ask for money. Any of my services, look in the description box below, okay? But anyway, let's go ahead and get started, y'all. Oh my goodness. Um, some could be going on with a household, okay, or two households, shit, or within somebody's family or somebody they live with or something of the nature. We got the number 15, that's the, that's the lover's card, okay. Um, so with that being said, Gemini, uh, is this you? Something going on at home with you, with you and someone, or your courtship or whatever. It's like with the Four of Pentacles, somebody here is worried about something other than you. It's like they keep ignoring you. And some of you want clarity about the situation. What is going on? Why this person not really, you know, paying you any mind, paying you any attention here, and shit like that. Okay? Um, this person is focused on their money at this time. They're, they're, I don't know, maybe they're just holding back here. Peer point blank. They're not really paying attention to what's in front of them. They're not looking at you. They're not being, um flirtations with you, touching you, you know, just whatever. If you, some of you could be feeling a little bit neglected from an individual, okay, that you could be living with or with. This ain't going to be everybody's story. But, um, yeah, so you see this person could be focused on their money or they could be working a lot, They're, you know, spending a lot of a time away from the home, working and shit like that. But here's the thing. With the um, courtship here in the family room, it's like, um, Something really needs to be looked at. I'm going to say you that now. Okay. Something really needs to be looked at. Um, they're either you're dealing with a queen of cups, a cancer person, Scorpio feminine, or this person is. Um, we got the nine of pentacles. Or no, let me say this. For some of y'all, you could be this queen of cups. That's my water bottle, y'all. Ooh, honey. All these damn omens. So you could be this damn queen of cups here. Okay, Gemini, it's like you, you could be a mother. Some of you could be, for whoever the feminine energy, it's like you are the mother here. You take care of the kids. You're very beautiful. You're very seductive. You know what I'm saying? Um, but you could feel like you're single in a household. You could feel like you're doing everything by yourself. Um, you could be, how they say, you're, you're, you're singly, you're single. But you're married, if that makes sense. Okay, you could be doing everything, making sure the house is tidy. Okay, what have you? And you're trying to communicate back and forth with this individual, but this person got their own something, something on their own mind. Okay, for others of y'all, this person could be planning to do something. I got Pisces energy, so this person could be running off and seducing another person because they may not feel satisfied, or you don't feel satisfied. And I'm talking about sexually or intimately. Emotionally, somebody doesn't feel satisfied in this situation. But the masculine figure, it seems like he's running off. Or it could be the feminine, put a word fits. Okay? But somebody here running off. They seducing or they trying to seduce another or find pleasure elsewhere. Some shit of that nature. So be careful who you're dealing with. Um, if you feel like something is off, Gemini, it is. But let me tell you this. Spirit is saying the only way for you to change the dynamic or um, get, you know, peace or whatever, you're going to have to move. Or some of you, like, move or kick this person out of your home or something of that nature. Or not deal with them or abandon them completely, okay? Even if you don't live with each other. But this, this is how this person is going to receive their karma. They're going to be in the Five of Pentacles energy in the Five. <laughs> Let the fuck out in, out in the cold, okay? And karma, justice energy, Libra energy. So this is their karma. This is going to be their karma. They want to go out here and play out and be in two different households or uh, talk to other people or whatever like that. Okay, go ahead and do that. And you're going to see what's going to happen to you. See, people don't realize they be taking advantage of the person that's there for them and really care for them and want a future with them. They be out here, um, you know, thinking about their own selfish needs, but not really thinking about the consequences behind their shit. That will be tripping me out by some people and these shaders and shit. But anyway, so we have the Seven of Swords. So this person been planning, going out with somebody here. We putting you in a competition with the Five of Wands. But this person going to get caught up and get catch something they haven't already. Okay? Yeah, uh, six of cups. So this is this is like past energy here, but at the same time it happened. I don't know if uh, mm. hold on, y'all. Y'all. So somebody here. 
could have caused something and it's going to lead to an argument because once you find out or whatever okay um yeah but maybe there was a child involved as well let me say this if somebody still got baby mama or whatever like that they're still sleeping off sleeping with that bitch or that dude okay i'm gonna tell you right now shit yeah this person ain't thinking about their consequences they haven't thoughts about a child i don't know i don't know a child maybe a son or a daughter here Whoever this individual is and that spine on you, seeing what you got going on. This person definitely has a lot of promiscuous energy. We got Sagittarius energy here. So be watchful, okay? But somebody here has definitely been sneaking out, trying to do something because they're, they feel like they're unemotionally um, or physically, okay, unsatisfied. So some of y'all put that energy where it fits, okay? But yeah, so just be watchful. What else, Holy Spirit? Mm, the devil. That's what I tell y'all. Seven of Wands. So some of you, you have this could have happened in your past with the Six of Cups. Because with the Seven of Wands, it's like you're protecting yourself from this individual, whoever they are. You're protecting yourself, okay? Um, you know this person is obsessed with you. Or there's a baby mama that's obsessed. I don't know. Or, yeah, somebody here is obsessed, though, okay? Somebody here is definitely obsessed. I'm getting Libra energy, Capricorn energy. Somebody's obsessed with you if you are this Empress energy, Gemini. This person is still obsessed with you. Okay, but they still out here doing the dirt or whatever like that. And I'm cheating and catching STDs and shit like that. So if you have anybody from your past that's wanted to reconnect or whatever the fuck may be. Um, this person now could be in poverty. They still out here chasing ass and shit like that. Gemini, do not accept this person's car or anything of that nature. Because this person is still out here doing shit they ain't supposed to be doing. Okay, keep protecting yourself, love. Yeah. So this person wants to reunite with you with the Three of Cups. Like I said, they have a possession of you. This could be a King of Wands. Okay, masculine. Yeah, this person could be at a distance as well. What else? Yeah, Ten of Cups. Oh, my goodness. What's this? Boom. So some of you, you could be in a relationship with a King of Wands. Okay, somebody that's fucking loyal as fuck. All right, is what I'm getting here. Mm. And you're ending a situation with someone. Yeah, we got the King of Cups. And ooh. So there's a King of Cups here. A Cancer Prize, a Scorpio, or somebody that's just in love with you. That's not, they don't, like, this person is not giving up. They want this new beginning with you. Okay, they're not taking no for an answer here, Gemini, whoever this person is. So we got the Queen and the King of Cups. So somebody here is not taking no for a fucking answer. Maybe you became single because of the situation you dealt with in your past or whatnot. And now you got somebody here that wants a new beginning with you. This person is very serious. They're not going to play any games or play around with you. Who's this King of Cups? Yeah, so somebody here. Oh my goodness. What is this energy? Yeah. Now we got a Queen of Wands energy. There's a lot of people in this motherfucking reading. Nine of Cups. So, somebody's heartbroken and sad over you because they find you very attractive. They find that you're innocent. You know, you're, I'm about to say innocent. Your personality, you're very reserved. You're very, like, kept to yourself here. Okay? And someone here, it's like they're, they're. Yeah, then we got the Queen of Swords. This is you. You are this empress, so you embody every fucking queen. So it's like you got the truth about this situation, and you're going to let somebody know. And there's going to be a tire moment for their stupid asses. It's like you gambled with it, and guess what? You lost it, bitch. It is what it is. It's the energy that I'm getting. Okay, somebody gambled with you. Yeah, now you're about to go towards this new opportunity here with the Ace of Pentacles. All right. Yeah, seven of wands. And continue to protect yourself and your finances. Period, boo. Okay, you don't give a fuck this person out on the streets, homeless, broke. Okay, sad, in and out. Oh, well. That ain't your problem. Yeah, you, you only deal with loyalty. Okay, you only deal with people that's going to fuck with you the right way. Okay, that's going to have your back. Period. You don't deal with nothing less than. Okay, now somebody's in regret here with the five of cups. Okay, soaking, crying over this shit. Yeah, boom. I can't make it up. King of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. You're not repeating the same fucking cycle over and over again. Okay, you send it to the motherfucking bag. Yeah, we got the lover's card, Gemini. You chose your lover. Okay, you chose your fucking lover. Pure point blank. Yeah, high priestess. All right, you're very intuitive and you're very in tune. You have grown since the last time you dealt with this individual. And you're also a fucking magician. 
Okay, Gemini? You create your life. All right? You, you will be damned if you go back to the past. I don't know what this person was thinking. Okay, honey, please. Yeah, they want to send you a message, but baby, you ain't because... Oh, that's what the message in the child was about. Somebody's going to use your children. If you have ch children with this individual, they're going to use your child as a pawn to get back in with you. Okay? But don't fall for the, don't fall for the trick. Okay? Pure point blank. Gemini, let it go. Boom. You got this. Anyway, I'm going to end it right there, Gemini. If you guys need anything else from me, look in the description box below. I love you guys. I'll see you guys Friday. Love you guys. Bye.